that what we're seeing in Toledo is a gang problem. That's according to Toledo Mayor Wade Kapsikavich. After a spike in gun violence this year, the mayor calling on the media to talk about a crime sweep set to launch this weekend. Emily Cohn was there and joins us now live. And Emily, the mayor stated in this press conference, violent crime numbers are down, but really the most recent numbers show that is not the case. Yes, the mayor repeatedly referred back to the 1990s when his current opponent, former mayor Cardi Finkbeyer, was mayor. Kapsikavit says violent crime was higher than today, where numbers are much lower. We requested those numbers from the administration, but let's take a look at the data we received just last week. Now, on Monday, police told us that since January 1st of this year, the city has experienced 1,209 shooting incidents. In those incidents, 174 people were shot. If we look back to 2020, compared to 2019, according to the 2020 Toledo Police Annual Report, we saw 57 homicides up for 35, 223 rapes, which is up from 202, and 2,221 aggravated assaults up from 1,722, 28. The mayor attributes what we're seeing in Toledo today as a gang problem and says almost all tragedies the city is seeing this year are gang related. He has those gun related homicides are very targeted targeted and the average person has nothing to worry about. The average Toledoan who plays by the rules and is simply trying to, you know, raise his kids and go to work and pay the bills and, you know, take the kids to soccer prep. That citizen uh, is so mathematically unlikely to be a victim of what we're talking about that it is irresponsible to think about it in any other way. And ahead at six, why is the city having two clean sweeps if violence is down in the city? I'll have more on that coming up at six. Reporting in downtown Toledo, Emily Cohen, WTOL 11.